Hi, in this video we're going to be doing a test. We're going to see if the spoon is actually made of silver. So this is a precious metal testing kit. It can test for gold, silver, or uh, platinum slash palladium. And the instructions tell you how to do all the tests. The silver one is super easy. You scratch it on the stone, you put one drop, and then you use this to determine if it's silver. So. I've already opened the silver solution. This is the one for silver. And then you get different ones, by the way. Um, you have these over here. So these are uh, different. These are for like different types of gold. So for example, this one's 14 karat gold. This one is 18 karat gold. You're supposed to use gloves, by the way. I'm pretty sure this stuff is acid, so you don't, you don't want to touch it. 10 karat gold, I accidentally touched some of it. Uh, a minute ago, uh, 22 carats, so I ran to the bathroom and washed my hands. I'm fine, there's no issues, but like, it does say, you know, use gloves, so be careful. I'm being extremely careful. Um, and then this is acid neutralizer. Okay, so the first step is to scratch the silver, which you see there's already a scratch there. I'm going to go ahead and do another scratch for you, just so you see how easy it is. So you take the spoon, or whatever you're doing, a coin, and that's the scratch right there, that's it. Very, very simple scratch, right? Just that's the scratch. Okay, now I'm gonna take this stuff. By the way, this was sealed. So this, actually this one isn't, but the other ones have like this plastic thing which you had to take off. And and um, when I went to pour some stuff on earlier, nothing came out. So I had to take this pair of scissors here. Let me show you the scissors I used. And you see there's some liquid on the scissors. That's acid, right? That's from this because I had to cut it open and so I got acid on my paper and my scissors here. So be really careful with this stuff, right? All right, I'm gonna carefully open this and I'm gonna put one drop. Let's zoom in so we can see the color changes. And then we'll look at the chart and hopefully this is silver, it's supposed to be silver. Also, I wanna test something else. We're gonna do a couple tests in this video. All right, let's see. It's gonna be very careful. One drop, it says one drop, so. Okay, come on. It takes a little bit of while to come out. There we go. Okay, I don't know if anything came out there. I don't. I don't there we go. There we go. So I don't know if this is going to be enough to determine um, if it's silver. It's, you see how long it says to wait. I'm not noticing any color changes yet. It says uh, fine silver, 0.999 uh, bright red. 0.925 is uh, dark red. 0.8 is brown. 0.5 is green. So the really bright red color is the highest, 0.999, and then bright red is 0.925, and then this silver brown, it would be 0.8, and then that would be uh, 0.5. So from the highest silver to the lowest silver content. I am not seeing anything yet. Um, it does seem a little bit dark red here. I am seeing some dark red. I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up here. Let's see if we can, the lighting in here is pretty okay. Um, looks pretty dark to me still. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it spread here on some of the other markings I made. See if I can see uh, any changes in the color. Because I poured a lot. Yeah, it still takes, takes some time. So uh, again, not seeing anything. It still seems pretty dark to me. I'm guessing like the color is somewhat like the 0.8 here, so that, that's what I'm seeing here with this one. Yeah, so hard to tell, right? Hard to tell uh, if it's actually silver. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put another drop. Well, I'm gonna slide it over here because I've, I've got some liquid on there. Let's put some on the other marking there. You know, maybe I, uh, maybe I didn't, uh, um, you know, do it firm enough. So let's try it again. That's pretty firm, right? I really, I really cut into the stone that time. Let's try that. Maybe you have to be firmer, right? Let's let's see. It's a learning process. Here we go. Okay, there we go. All right. Let's see if that has a noticeable difference versus the other one. I, I feel like it's a little bit more red already, but it's really hard to tell. This silver passes the magnet test. So I used a magnet and um, this was this was okay. So yeah, I definitely see the red in there. It's definitely turning red where I scratched it though. Yeah, I mean that's that's where you're supposed to look, I guess. 
at that scratch mark. And I would say it's definitely red. I don't know if it's coming out in the camera, but it's it's definitely, uh, I would say it's it's here. I would say it's here. This would be my guess, so 0 0.925. Yeah, 0 0.925. Let's do something I know is not silver. So I've got this piece here. Let's try this. Okay, let's put some acid on this and let's see what this looks like. A little bit there, okay. See if there's a difference. I'm pretty sure that handle is not the, the, what I just scratched is not silver. Should not be, I think it's like steel or something. And it's hard to see here. I'm just gonna get a better view here in the light. Yeah, no, no, no color at all now. So there is a definitely, I, I don't know if you can see it. You probably can't in the camera, but there is a definite difference between here there's some brightness from the silver, here there's nothing. It's just completely dull and black. So you probably can't see it with, with the lighting here, uh, but I am seeing, I am seeing some, some dark red here, uh, lines where I scratch in here, I'm not seeing anything. So I would say that it is successful. So there it is, uh, kind of a long video. I wanted to show you a real test, uh, how it actually works, you know, the trials and tribulations of actually using the silver test for the first time on your own. This is what it's gonna be like. So I am seeing, and I know you probably can't see it uh, with the lighting here, and it's pr I'm in a pretty bright room, but I am noticing that I have a red line here, okay? And I have one here as well, but here, you, you can't see it in the camera, there's nothing. It's just nothingness. So that confirms that this is not silver, and this is. So hopefully, uh, this is giving you an idea of what this test is like. Um, I think it's pretty good. It's certainly better than not having the test, but it is a little bit hard to see. And only the part where the scratch discolors, you really have to look at that scratch and that's where you can see it's red. I don't know if you could see it there. Let me zoom in even more. There you go. Yeah, it's not really coming out in the camera. Anyways, silver test. And you can also test for gold, platinum, and palladium with this thing. Kind of a long video, but I just wanted to show you how it all works. And you get and you get two stones. You get two stones. I hope it's been helpful. Good luck.